Carnivore challenge day nine. So same old, same old, just sticking with it. I mean, meat, water, like eggs, steak, cheese. That's kind of it. Um, I don't know. Everything's great. I don't really have any comments to make. I mean, you feel great. You got lots of energy, no aches and pains. I mean, you sleep great. I've, I've not ever had trouble sleeping, so that's never been a problem, but I just, my energy is great. And obviously the aches and pains, that's the thing. Like my whole body would hurt. Just my feet would hurt every time I get up to walk on them. My back would hurt. And then super bad. Um, I would have always super anxious feeling. And even like I couldn't breathe. I had all the time feeling like I couldn't breathe. Like I couldn't get a deep breath. I know now that was like from acid reflux. Like who knew that that was cause you something stupid like that. But anyways, yeah, um, I feel good. My cravings really have gone away. I mean, it's, I want to say it's 12 or after 12 right now. I haven't ate anything. <laughs> I mean, I've been a little busy, but I still have literally not ate anything, drank a cup of coffee or anything. I've just drank a bottle of water, and actually, I'm I'm pretty much starving right now. So, yeah. But, I mean, just, I don't know. You just don't really think about food. You just don't really think about food like you did, where it was just every single minute. You're like, oh, my God, give me a donut, a cake, a cookie, some chips to hold me over five minutes, and then I'll eat some more donuts, cakes, cookies, chips, like... It's absolutely ridiculous. I don't know why when you eat sugar, you just want more and more and more and more and more. Like you, and it's obviously readily available. So we just give more and more. Um, my favorite thing is ribeyes. I, I do, you know, like salmon and some fish and shrimp and stuff like that. Um, I, I'm out of my electrolytes right now. I definitely need those, but I don't really take anything. I don't have a gallbladder, so I do, if I'm eating something just super heavy and super fatty or anything that's like hot dogs or anything like that, I do try to take like uh, betaine and ox bile or digestive enzymes. Like I always try to take those, so I don't get, I mean, obviously not having a gallbladder, you can get nauseated feeling, but that's actually gone away a lot or even eating a lot of greasy cheese like i don't really get that feeling anymore so that's definitely a super improvement but um obviously i recommend it but here we go i just hope i just can't imagine though after after the 30 days not wanting i don't know not wanting like fried oysters, like just some things I can just see that I would think I would want. I mean, maybe I could go with just steamed oysters or something like that. I don't know why I've been craving oysters. Maybe it's some kind of vitamin that they have in them. And then, I don't know, we fry fish a lot and we just do a lot of get together. So I just would like to be able to stick with this permanently, but I'm like, gosh, do you just forever permanently eat this way? And obviously, all the carnivores would tell you yes. So, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I mean, 30 days sick into it, I would think after 30 days, maybe you're like, dude, I'm going to keep going. So, yeah, let's see if I keep going. <laughs>